Now, I mentioned before the unfortunate fact that in Russian, you cannot predict a verb's conjugation pattern simply by looking at the infinitive. That is, unless your verb ends in ovat, like the verb risavat. Ovat type verbs have a very predictable pattern, and you don't need to memorize any forms if you know it. All you need to do is drop the ovat, replace it with u. This will give you your present future stem and then conjugate a verb by adding personal endings. Я рисую, ты рисуешь, она рисует, мы рисуем, вы рисуете, они рисуют. There are many common verbs in this type. For example, the verb советовать. Once you've determined that it's an ovat verb, you drop the ovat and can easily derive your present future stem. Then you conjugate it by adding personal endings. Я советую, он советует, они советуют. Танцевать is another example of this type of verb. Note, however, that since it's affected by the five-letter rule, ovat becomes jevat in unstressed position. Otherwise, it follows the same pattern with the present future stem танцу. Я танцую, ты танцуешь, они Танцуют. Once again, reflexive verbs with ovat will follow the same pattern with the addition of ся after the ending. Я интересуюсь, вы интересуетесь, они интересуются. Watch the next video to learn about another type with a very predictable conjugation pattern, the давать, ставать, знавать type.